Last time on the Ultra Publications Let's Play of Red Rogue, we learned that the ran that Ring, the god of randomness, can create an orgy of minions, all with boners. And they all spank some nymphs. It was very erotic. You shouldn't have missed it. Then we gave our minion the gun blade, turning him into an undead squall. We're sure that's someone's fetish. And all the undead fangreed and happiness. Uh, if it is in fact your fetish, don't share with us, please. The horse chasing me again. Crap that's going on, on screen right now. I'm just running away from the whore. I'd run away from the horse too. Don't whores usually charge money first? That's why you have to run away from them. What are we gonna do? Attack you? Oh, those are banshees. Banshees can run through walls, just so you know. They're really annoying. Well, banshees are a type of ghost in some cultures, I guess. Aren't they in most cultures that have banshees? Isn't it like... Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm confusing cultures and video games again. Oh, there goes the Balrog. We need a strong Donkey Kong vibe with how much of a puss this guy is. So we're going to fight him here, or... He's trying to shoot the gun blade and it's not working. And a nymph of them, Fedora. And they've, they're all pretty dapper here, all the monsters. They're going to a fancy party. Holy crap, it's destroying me. The monster mash? Oh god, the monster just mashed the rogue in the face. Minion, eat him, kill him. Ah, I pick up a chakra. You know what, maybe I should use the... No. Shulkram, now we can be Xena! Wait, it was a cursed gun. Uh, it was a cursed gun. Of course it was! Is there such a thing as a non-cursed gun blade? Oh, I thought you said the Shulkram was cursed. <sighs> Am I... Oh, oh dude. Maybe that's why only Squall can use them. The stupid, uh... <laughs> it took my staff off and I didn't notice no one I was getting my butt. Oh, so you're saying what drove Cypher mad was the fact that he was holding a gun blade? Sure, bring up the confusing storyline of Final Fantasy VIII, Clovis. Good boy. It may well be the second worst Final Fantasy game, not counting the online games. At least in the storyline. I picked up bees because... Storyline and the battle mechanics. Okay, that's a lot of the game that sucks. <laughs> yeah, I will say what's left. Um, the pretty, pretty graphics. So level 13? I didn't think there were more levels. Ah, crap, I missed my chance to kill the Balrog. You could have killed him with that, yeah. Yeah, I ha that's how I did it last time. Uh-huh. I quickening him with death. Cheat the boss by using the quickening on him. Well, let's see if we can well, find well, anyone who saw the Highlander TV show or movies know the quickening is really good at destroying everything around it. And now I've we know... Sorry, what do you say? I've never seen any of them. I'm going to uh... identify the gunblade. Um, okay. The gunblade's true name is Dernwern. Dernwin. I don't get it. Does anyone get it? Nope. And we shall never speak out of it again. <laughs> Didn't we see the door to the next level down back there? We'll never speak of it again until Final Fantasy 13. Will that bring it back? No. At least Final Fantasy 13 was a better game than 8. I never played it, but I have to agree. It didn't seem like it tried something different, at least. I actually enjoyed that one. How about 13 too? I haven't played it. Neither have I. I haven't played any Final Fantasy since 12. You know they're making a 13-3, and I'm not making that up. I've I, heard of it, yes. I've heard, and I'm not entirely pleased by that. 
I never identified rune. I, I still have some left. That might be like a polymorph rune. I don't think I want that. Feed it to your minion, see what happens. If it's polymorph rune, I don't think I want to feed it to my minion. You might get something worse than a skeleton. It polymorphs him into another skeleton. <laughs> da da da! Polymorphs him into the Balrog. More you mimics. Have won everything. That would be awesome! Your minion polymorphs into Goku. You use the spirit bomb to destroy every single undead creature. Including your minion, because he was technically undead. But then I open but a minion only portal. Harms, it only harms an evil undead. Oh, you're the right. evil dead, you know? Well, if we're dealing with the evil dead, we need to get a shotgun and a chainsaw armed. And in some cases, a midget. Surrounded by girls. Stop running, you bitch! Oh crap, I accidentally used the portal. Oh, he opened the underworld portal. That was very nice of him. Yay! He's being nice to us. This is making me really paranoid. RNG, making you paranoid by doing what you See, want. See, it's called Dernwin now. <laughs> Maybe that's why it's a special gun, gun blade that's always cursed. Oh crap, I so hit a portal over. You didn't give him the item, the, the gun blade back? Yeah. Well, that teleported you to somewhere at least. To the other side of the boss. Yeah. <laughs> they can cut him off even though he knows exactly where you are, apparently. Alright, minion. Go get him. Kick his ass. Minion, what are you doing? Kill him. Are we doing any damage? Yes. I think his health is on the right. Oh crap, he's got me stuck. He's got you pinned. This is really bad. Um, do I have a teleport rune? That's great. I'm eating. Well, you could level up. <sighs> got a good point. Oh, the nymph stole his equipment. <laughs> I got to re-equip my Those minion. Those girls. <laughs> it's like I'm over here. Oh, why am I minion naked? <laughs> Your minion is naked because he wants to get his bone on. Hurt, hurt, hurt. Oh, and he just died again. What's killing him? Alright. Um. Do I have any. Yeah. I just ate a ru rune of XP. <laughs> I just ate a rune of rune. It was a rune of XP. <laughs> and that leveled us up. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> and we killed the Balrog. There goes the Balrog, no head. So you actually had a rune of XP. <laughs> sure, why not? I actually was wondering if you actually had one of those and it was actually going to work. <laughs> Man, that's a lot of blood in his head. Uh, that's amazing. Once again, we have justified the at's love. <laughs> and I can so pick up the the surface or what? <laughs> there goes the body again. <laughs> He's so ready. You picked up the Balrog's face. You can now equip it to your minion. Equip it. Equip it. Uh, no, I, one of these scrolls warned against it. And I, that might be a really bad idea. Okay. But now, if we go down here into the underworld, and now he's alive again. At became husband. Yay! Husband needs to take that helmet off. Yeah, isn't that husband? And yeah, SD's right. Isn't that helmet bad for living people? Mm, not really. Still got a heal enchant on it. I love that we're still calling it the minion. We yeah. know who wears the pants in this marriage. Rogue. Get back here. 
So now we have to walk all the way back out. Mm, only if, until we find an overworld portal. Yeah, he has to go to the overworld, then he's done. Oh, okay. Do we have a rune of portal? Oh, okay. Yes. I the last one. Oh, never mind. Yay! I was afraid we have to walk all the way back up. A uh, win roar is you. What the fuck? Did we just blow up? No, the chaos dungeon is blowing up. Can't you read Clovis? Oh, okay. Remember, kids, reading is good for you. It makes you seem like less of a dumbass. And also, he keeps teleporting. RNG opens the way home. Isn't he nice today? Don't Do we trust RNG to actually open the way home? I don't know. Maybe that's part of the ending. You want to read, Clovis? You want to read? Like her husband before her. <laughs> Red Rogue was given a new name on her return. She was now part of pole position. Red Robin. Yum. Hearing of her use of the rune of time and her constant cheating of death, they named her... Immortal. Oh, do you get a different ending depending on how much you died? Uh, no, actually, but so, so, it's... There are parts to the ending that change, but it's all completely random. She and her husband retired to their farm to live out quieter lives. Except with you, less spanking of nymphs. Except you Aww. can actually get the ending without trading the amulet to re resurrect the husband. Mm. And it has a bad ending. Ah. They had only one child whose life was unremarkable, but gave joy to the married couple every day. Their son, in keeping with world tradition, they named Boring Son. Thankful to merely have each other after being apart in flesh, they led simple lives until the end of their days. The immortal's husband was not, was, was not full enough to send his wife on yet another errand. When her husband died, he returned to the underworld again. And he came back this time. When the immortal died, the rune of the rune of time took effect. Perhaps the world continued without her, or perhaps it was erased as she was pulled back through time. See, we didn't we didn't die, so I never said it. But if every time you die, you reincarnate back at the overworld, or at the oh. first level. But anything in the overworld stays the same. And so, in other words, every time she dies, she has to do this all over again. Also, Wedge made a perfect run through, basically. The Immortal looked into eternity and descended. And New Game Plus, which we're not going to do. Dungeons. But your name and is now Immortal. But uh, just I don't think we saw. I don't think we saw any dragons. But just to show you, like, runes and stuff I left are still here. Like, I can huh. grab this equipment, and I suddenly have... Hair? No. Hair's there. always been there. But anyway, and if I go down to the overworld portal, I end up at level 13. <laughs> and die horribly. Uh, here, you just die horribly. <laughs> <laughs> so, what, Wedge, what would be new what on a new need? game plus? Rock and Shasha's, apparently. We never saw them before. They didn't show up. Right. We found, a new, a, we found a new novel way to die. I'm apparently. guessing on I'm guessing on a new game plus you can find monsters actually worth turning the skeleton into. But they're probably harder than balls. Mm, I think the enemies are just... Stronger and normal in the game plus. So it's hard mode, gotcha. Yeah. Anyway, that's about it for this game. Oh, it remembers that it's at this time. Yeah, any, anything you have in your lore, which we didn't really show, uh, like, still remembers that we identified the gunblade. So you get the gunblade mm -hmm. stats. No. Also, uh, like, it'll, that, that's the stats for the. Uh, in character. Well, 
already, then. That's about it. Well, everybody, this has been the Ultra Publications Let's Play of Red Rogue. It had lots of murder. And a headless... What was that called? Oh, yes, and a headless Balrog. How many times do you get to see that? <laughs> you may not pass. There can only be one! <laughs>